Here's Kwang Yang. No way beyond Mikel. This pass, though, was poor. Given away, and uh, Kitschi could be in here. And Kitschi lead. It's Yago who scored. We have played just seven minutes. And Arsenal fall behind in Hong Kong. And a moment to save it for the locals here. Kitschi won. Arsenal nil. Well, all the frailties of Arsenal were shown there. Try and play the ball into midfield. It's very tight. Diaby has the ball taken off of him. Arsene Wenger doesn't look too pleased. Nor he shouldn't. And then the next boys play inside of Mikel. There he plays the ball into midfield. It's not a particularly good one. It's one back. And then he gets caught a little bit square. There's no cover. And it's a really good pass and a good finish from Yago. Diaby's got to do better. He's got to try and get his body in the way. The body position of Mikel was all wrong, and Giroud couldn't get round on the cover. Not one for Steve Bold or Arsene Wenger to be pleased about. For the Here's Mikel. The one two is Shamak. Mikel going on. Shamak again. It's fine football until the finish. Oh, Mikel coming out from the back. Did it well, played a couple of one-twos. There's the first one, then he reverses it back into the path of Shamak. Raymond gets the first block in, and then Shamak, I thought, should really have finished it there, bending it into that far corner. Just lacks confidence. Close down by Resio. One back by TRB, and Walcott's in the clear. And Arsenal are level. Theo Walcott with the finish. Kitschi appealing for offside. There was no flag forthcoming. And the Gunners are back on level terms. Well, Diaby had the ball pinched off him for Kitschi's goal. This time he closed down and won the ball back. Ball played in here. He wins the ball back. Hint of a foul. Certainly no offside. And a very calm finish from Theo Walcott in at the near post. Was it a foul on Yang? Well, he's got to be a bit stronger. They stopped playing. Kitschke. That's a lovely touch there by Kai Wei to open up Arsenal again. Mikel back in the nick of time. Juru scampering in now. It'll come to Yago. Good save by Chesney. But the rebound's turned in. Kitschke lead again. Thumped home by Danny Cancela. Wonderful scenes for the Kitschy supporters. And before the half hour, Arsenal trail once more. Once again, it was from Kawai in midfield. This is the last bit of it. And Sailor gets the ball across the box. Arsenal don't deal with this one. There's the first chance. It's a good save from Chesney. And Saylor was quick to get the next one in. He was more alert. Arsenal not defending well. It's a common theme. Something that Arsene Wenger and Steve Bold have got to sort out. Toes. Now to Yabi, and Arsenal with a potent break on here. Three going forward. Mano and Shabak. Diaby again. Very good chance to level the game with Tutu. He failed to take. Yeah, that's what Diaby can do. Driving out from his own edge of his own penalty box, played it to Shamak, continued his run, lets the ball run across his body, just slicing it wide. The pitch played its part as well, just bobbling up there. There by Oxlade Chain with it, and Javinho has done really well. And Afobe hits the post, and then the rebound over the top. What a great chance there for Arsenal. Javier did superbly, but Afobe couldn't provide the finish. Well, excellent start from Arsenal. Great degree of intensity. Ball was played into Javinho, skips past a couple of challenges, sets it up nicely for Afobe, just tried to pass it into the corner. Didn't quite get it right, but they won the ball back through Oxlade Chamberlain. Javinho bursting past Raymond. Very unselfishly pulls it back. He's going to do a little bit better, the young 
substitute. Lancing towards this near side. Here we go. Great little change of pace. And there's the lift into the box, and you couldn't get a better cross than that. Really, I thought they should score. Here's the change of pace, change of direction. And the awareness and the ability just to lift it up into the danger area. Zavinia. Arsenal had the bit between their teeth again. And Zavinia's in full fly here. It's Icebox. It's 2 2. And the young German scores his second goal of this Far East tour. But Javinho takes all the plaudits. Well, Javinho in the second half, he's running with the ball, has been exceptional. He squared up the two defenders in front of him. And he just went past them with that speed off the mark here. And what he does this time, he finds the right pass. And it's an easy finish for Eisfeld. Javinho's looked sharp, he's looked quick. There, you can actually see him get his head up and look for the pass. All the good footwork, but they're giving it away. Javinho, it's gone beyond Quang Ye. Resio's there again, Javinho charging on still. He's kept the ball in play too. It's an equal.